Angela and Daniela, and we are making the Bruce Bogtrotter cake from Matilda. So this should be very, mm, very tasty. Very tasty. Um, so let's just kind of jump right in, and as we go, awesome. I'll like ask some questions or whatever. But the very, very first thing it says to do is preheat the oven to 350, and butter and flour three inch or three of these things, which I've already done. You were oh amazing. Already, you already preheated? No, I have not preheated. You can do that, but the flowering has been handled. That's what that looks like. You just Preheating done. Preheating done. Pre oh my gosh, we now are jobs over. <laughs> <laughs> um, cool. And then we also need to get some water boiling. And while that's Amazing. happening, you guys can tell me a little bit about your series. If yes. You want. Just if you want. Like, yeah, we would love so to. Binge is just like Friends. If Friends <laughs> had anything to do with. A uh, real world. A uh, girl having an eating disorder. Monica, like, was bulimic. If Monica was bulimic, like, but she Monica definitely would have been was all bulimic. Well, no. <laughs> oh, no, I mean, she had Phoebe was probably fine, but the other the two other were two real skinny. Yeah, they disorders. were. Yeah. 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 For yeah. Sure. yeah. Oh, like Coke as an eating disorder? So. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's an eating disorder? It was like the 90s, right? It was so, the 90s, so they ew, definitely were. It was the like, You know what's on Nick at Night right now? Is it really? That makes me feel good. You guys. For real. I didn't actually watch it really when it was on. Like, it I wasn't watching. Was, like, was not my jam. Oh my god, I watched it every single day. I was addicted, and I thought Chandler was the funniest thing in the world. He was. Be just like him. Very funny. Speaking of addictions, though. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> so, binge. Yes. Binge, <laughs> yes. Binge is a uh, a series. Um, it's a TV pilot right now, um, written by myself and our friend who is not with us. Any longer. No, he's still alive. <laughs> he's still alive. He's still alive. He's just not here. He's uh, the head of HLG and very alive and well. Um, his name is Yuri Baranowski. Uh, Yuri also played, we were both in a series together, he played Death in The oh. Boris. So I, I don't know that we were in a scene together, but we like annoyed people on set together. Oh, good. Well, that's okay. Yeah, no. Actually, have I ever, other than, other than the one thing, I don't know that I've ever actually acted with him. Don't do it. It's the worst. <laughs> Yuri's the worst. He's the worst. Just kidding, he's the best. And we wrote this pilot together called Binge. Um, and it is based on, or inspired by, um, my decade-long struggle with an eating disorder, uh, primarily bulimia. So it's this edgy, sort of in-your-face, raw look at um, a character quite like myself named Angela, which is my name. Um, <laughs> you really, really, really went far. Really went this. far. Um, just about her, her struggle with an eating disorder. Um, the pilot episode we filmed it this summer. Um, Donnie plays my best friend in the series and my worst enemy in real life. I'm, I'm her worst enemy in real life. That's a joke, but it didn't. It, it didn't land, land up with the audience that we don't <laughs> yeah, really didn't like funny. it. Um, <laughs> just so you guys know what I'm doing as I'm doing it, we've got uh, cocoa powder and uh, two ounces of chocolate chips that just went in, and then we're going to put boiling water on top of them and melt them down. So yeah, so Binge is, is, is a pilot. Uh, we made it this summer. It's 25 minutes long, and two weeks ago from today, the day that we're filming, which is what, December... 12th. December the computer 12th. says December 12th. December 12th. Uh, we released oh, it two really. weeks ago um, on YouTube Thank independently, you. very grass, grassroots sort of thing. Um, and as of today, we have 18,000 views. Wow. A little yeah. over 18,000. Wow. Over 18,000. Yeah. I just checked right before I came in. Yeah. Oh, so I do that frequently now. I do too, nonstop. Yeah. Like I know. A psychopath. We're not addicted to anything. We're not no. addicted to anything. No problems there. Uh, but we've had some awesome uh, write-ups in Refinery29 and Thought Catalog. Buzzfeed. Wow. Buzzfeed, yeah. This, uh, the Establishment, Tangential, IndieWire. Oh, yeah, IndieWire. Um, Elite Daily. We have a couple of... Uh, so so of this is really the cherry. So this here. is the cherry. <laughs> <laughs> no, but you are. <laughs> um, um, but yeah, it's been really exciting and... Sort of our goal with it is, you know, we've been kind of pitching it around town a little bit, not not a ton over the last couple of years, um, 
And while people have really liked it, you know, the subject matter is edgy and it makes people uncomfortable. Not a lot of people know much about eating disorders, um, but we have been really convinced that there is an audience for it because a people lot of there is. Out. Because a lot of people have struggle with eating disorders. It's like a really, really common thing. Um, and we were convinced that if we put it up online that people would watch it and want to see more. And it's happening, so we're really yeah, excited about really, it. Yeah, really, really good. I was telling Angela before everybody got here, like, it's beautifully shot. It's a normal pilot length, which is very hard for the web. It's it, yeah. it's really nice. It looks super professional. Like, you could turn on a television. It would be on Netflix or Amazon. It's Justin or Morrison for you. <laughs> Justin Morrison, one of the other main main people from HLG yeah. Studios. He's, he's the DP. He's, he's the DP and he's incredible. And yeah, he, he does great. things that like, I just, that's he's a ter maniac. They, they terrify me. Yeah. They terrify People me. People die shooting something would be really happy about it. Yeah. yeah. Like, yeah. Yeah. Uh, when he made the rig on, um, he built this crazy rig over my car. He took um, a couple of C stands. So. And for, for, for these friendly faces, yeah. what, is, what is a rig and what is oh. a C-stand? Oh yeah, <laughs> what even is it? A rig is just like a way to hold a camera, yeah. basically. And a C-stand is something that you'll prop, like, it's kind of like what we're propping the camera on. Right, right like a tripod. It's kind of like a tripod. It's like a little heavier. It's something different. Well, yeah. That's a crappy truck. <laughs> Point out. <laughs> it's just basically right. like, a, like a metal pole, so he essentially just like, connected two metal poles like sticking out. Didn't he do PVC pipes too? Yeah, and PVC yeah. pipes out the side of my car with a bunch of like, um, of those elasticy things. And, oh, like, bungee cords? Bungee things? cords yeah. and like tape, and taped this crazy freaking rig yeah. out of the side of his car. So the car is like here and the rig comes out and so the camera was like over my head, and he'd drive, and the camera would move. That's nuts. Because He's that's not, just because that's just. But him. you know what the like crazy thing? Big sets are the same way. Like there's yeah. more money to spend, so sometimes you can buy or rent like actual things for that. Mm -hmm. But you, they will hit a problem where they're like, how do we make this? Is that the thing we can do? Right. And then you, they just jerry rig stuff. So it's yeah. not. It's so weird to see them like. Do the same stuff that we're doing, just on a bigger scale. Yeah. And you're like, oh, yeah. yeah. It's crazy. All right, I'm not, yeah. not quite such yeah. a failure. Yeah. Um, so we're just still money. waiting for this. It's we do. Money. <laughs> we need money. Yeah. Yes, we all need it. But we're not asking for money. So, oh, yeah. like, the whole point of putting it out in the world um, is that we're just trying to get as much buzz and views around it as possible to hopefully gain the attention of the right showrunner, the right network. The right rich aunt sitting. You really want it to be an aunt. I do. I don't want it to I, be an uncle. You, but I do want it to be an uncle. I'll take it from anybody. I'll take yeah. it from anybody. Wow. He'll take it. He'll take it. He'll take it from anybody. Right now, honestly. Um, so this is a one third of a cup. Is that so unhelpful? One third ish of a cup of water that we're gonna put in here, and Danielle is gonna whisk until I'm, I'm whisking. Whisk, whisk, whisk. Oh, one. One it's supposed three. to be one and three fourths, so hang on. Oh, that's a lot more. That's a lot more. Yeah. <laughs> so I've already put one third in there. Uh oh. Don't ask yeah. me to do oh, that. Right. Not so here one that. and three fourths minus a third. Here we go. This smells delightful. Yeah. Okay. So now can I pour it in? Yes. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Ooh, oh my god, did I splatter you? No, oh, I'm so very careful with pouring. Yeah, I'm so sorry. Water. With three uh, people in this like, <laughs> one little area. Yeah. Um, so were you nervous about bringing your own personal experience to the screen? You know, it's it's been really interesting. So it's been up for two weeks, 1,800 views, 18,000. That's different than 100, 18,000 views. Yeah, oh, that's a, that's a big thing. Crap. Did it hurt you? No, Are you okay? Fine. Okay. It's totally fine. I'm sorry. This is not a burn. This is, oh. you guys can't even see it. This is, <laughs> when like I put on lipstick, I go like Oh, oh. that's smart. And then just like, like rub it off. And I was like, holy, holy shit. No, 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 no. I really hurt her. Okay. No. All right. Um, I remember the first time we did the read through, which yeah. was over two years ago, yeah. um, in front of our agents. Uh, and I remember specifically walking out of the elevator and your boyfriend uh, was like, was that weird for you? Yeah. And I don't know why I remember him like touching your hair like, like, hey, is that okay? And you kind of like turned and looked at him and yeah. I was like, oh my God, this is the first time that Angela ever heard this read out loud. Yeah, yeah. And um, <clears throat> I just, 
I found that to be interesting that not only did you read it in front of like, you know, me and Yuri yeah. and people that you've had a relationship with, but we read it in front of like actors that we, you know, that were just with the, the yeah. same agency. Yeah. And um, if that was me, I don't know if I could have done that in that type of an environment. Right. You know, talking about like anything personal, really, yeah. like that yeah. was like troublesome. Yeah. Um, in my past. Cause we're perfect. <laughs> we're so, um, yeah, because I'm perfect. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You don't have anything wrong with you and you never no have. No problems here. Yeah. Uh, but no, I, I just commended you <laughs> for that because with issues that I have had with mm -hmm. eating or anything really in general, I don't know if I could yeah, put them on. They feel so private. Yeah. Like, mm -hmm. I don't think I could put them on. I don't think I can put them on display quite like that yeah. Yeah. in that way. That seems really human and normal. What I'm doing seems really bizarre. Right, that's why everybody is like, it wow, it's so hard. Um, and I guess it's it's probably easier if like your family and your friends, everybody knows and you've right. grown past. Yeah, that, and that, like, yeah. That I'm sure Yeah. Helps. So let's see what's next. Uh, sift flour, baking soda, and baking powder into another bowl. You can give me a task too. I okay, that's that your anything. task. Until a little blended. I guess you need another bowl. Another bowl? Why? One of the guys from, that we were reading with, I uh -huh. found out later, was the guy from One Tree Hill. I know! I, I had no idea he was I famous. I didn't know either. I'm I like did. pissed I didn't realize I should yeah. be really excited. I know, me too. Well, I got into One Tree Hill after <gasps> um, because... Uh, we're talking about... about Tyler Hilton or Taylor Hilton? I don't know his real name. Tyler Hilton? His, he always refers to himself in the third person on the show. So okay. it's two and three fourths of a cup of He's a great actor. actor. He is a good actor and he's also a singer. And he's a singer. And he, did you watch One Tree Hill? No. And he was there at the reading. Did, did it have did. commercials in it? Have I told you this? You don't I wasn't allowed, no, I mean, today I'm like, oh, I was like, we're going to throw that streaming. I was like, you, but, you don't watch things in commercials now? You're not I mean, allowed? <laughs> I don't like, I don't, I don't have like TV anymore. I just have Netflix right. and Hulu and right. stuff, so I don't have commercials, but, um, which is such a shitty thing. I'm like, I don't watch commercials. Please, please put, put it in here. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so put it in, this just dump it. Okay. Okay. And then to sit. Kate's teaching me how to cook. Oh, can you guys see this? Probably not. Alright. Okay. Sorry. So we've got a little this thingy. Mm -hmm. Sifter. And you just tap it. Oh, so it's kind of spreads yeah. it out and declumps. Yeah. Oh, look at you, Gosh. Angela. You didn't know that? No. 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 That's fine. That's fine. My mom told me that <laughs> I should stay away from the... It's okay. I need a little more of that. Okay. Oh, God. That's not Here, all. Uh, that's not all of it. Yeah, that's easier. Wait, I need one and... You need two and... You didn't know this was going to be a comedy show. <laughs> Put me in the kitchen. Angela in the kitchen. All sorts of hygiene. So that's two. And how many do you need total? Three two. fourths. Yeah. Um, I don't know, but for something... For, there's some sort of like... I don't have a filter like most people do. Like I'm You really like, don't. I've always been like very, very open about my issues. Okay, same. So pause for a second. So yeah. we can put in the... Oh, pause. Um, oh, you can keep talking. Oh, baking soda, baking soda. but stop moving my hand. Yes. Got it. <laughs> so you, know, you have to do both. <laughs> okay. I can't do two things at once. Uh, one and four. So I wasn't super nervous, but the one thing that I didn't think about is how it would affect my family, me being really open about this. Oh. I didn't think about it, because I guess I'm obsessed with myself or something. How is it affecting your family? <laughs> um, not negatively, but like my mom, when she went home, or she went to visit family over Thanksgiving, right before you put it up, you know, had to field a bunch of questions about mm. okay, go ahead. people like in my extended family being like, is Angela... Can I just help you? Yeah. <laughs> so, like like um, that. It's easier like this. Okay. Okay, this guy's probably good. Okay, you can keep talking. Oh, about okay. <laughs> Well, she just had to field a bunch of questions about, you know, oh my god, we had no idea, Angela was bulimic, and... Oh, they didn't know. Not my extended family, no. Oh. Um, Does that take that? Does not because I was, like, actively hiding it from them, then, but that's not something here. I guess you talk about. Yeah. Okay. Uh, and an electric mixer beat sugars and mayonnaise into a large bowl. So here's our large bowl. I thought it was so interesting that you put mayonnaise in it. 
Oh, actually, do you, have you, okay, so when you're baking a cake, you should always put a little bit of mayonnaise or a little bit of sour cream in because it keeps it very moist. No idea. Mm -hmm. Or you can add an extra egg. That's usually Get out of here. You're, you're fired. <laughs> what? Oh. Sorry. I'm sorry. Oh no, I hope that didn't do what I think it did. Oh, no, no. Okay, oh, oh. I have all these questions prepared for you guys, and I thought it like just deleted <laughs> all of them. Oh. Um, do you hope to desensitize or de desensitize, destigmatize mental illness by being very open about it? Yeah, I think so. I hope so. You know, I I mean, well, don't yeah. you? I feel like I feel like as far as mental illness goes, like the general consensus is, if you don't see an issue like right in front of you. It, it, you're not sick. Right. You're not sick. Right. You're making it up. Deal with it. And yeah. the majority the stronger person. of people with eating disorders look quote unquote fine. Normal. Yeah, whatever. So we got that means. one cup of regular sugar and then one cup of brown sugar. Brown sugar. Which I'm going to do in the little ones. So it's in this so adorable, it's really adorable, stupid little thing. It's interesting because like, there are so many shows about alcoholism, mm -hmm. and alcoholism is something that I think everyone kind of agrees, yeah, it's serious. Mm -hmm. For sure. If someone has a problem with it, they need to get help, you should be supportive. Alcoholism can look differently, it affects all people, ages, races, you know, but with eating disorders, there's this idea that it's like young, rich, white girls. Is it, do you think a which little I realize that I'm too? Like, yeah, absolutely. You know, Boys can have yeah. this thing, but yeah. girls, girls eating can. disorder, like, who yeah. cares? Yeah. I, I also feel like, too, with, like, bulimia, it's, like, not the accepted No, it's disorder. not the hot, you're not hot, yeah, you're, you're not, not bulimia. Yeah, exactly. Okay. It's not like anorexia no? where it's, like, this girl that needs to be saved, yeah. right, that is, like, all weak and stuff. And she's like... And looks like a supermodel. She looks like a supermodel, and she's just striving to look even better than... than yeah. And that's that's something that like is interesting to me because it's it's just a different spectrum of right. of wanting the same idea. I'm sorry, mm -hmm. wanting the same ideal. Yeah, it's funny. Um, the that look, that emaciated look. Yeah, has been attractive for a very long time. Yeah, uh, the tuberculosis look was yeah. attractive, which is so, so weird for like well, did women to be take mercury or something. Yeah, to sit and stay thin. Yeah. I do some stupid stuff. Right now. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah. But an eating disorder isn't really just about no being thin. No, right? it's not. So it's about it's not. Right. Yeah, like, it's about, about a lot of things. Yeah, it's about a lot of things. Yeah. I mean, and I it's different for everyone. What sort of is that work triggers? We're mm -hmm. putting. It says put uh, one and one thirds cup of mayonnaise in. So we are doing that. If you don't like mayonnaise, you can use sour cream, but you won't taste it at all. It's not a big deal. I don't mean to. Okay. It's funny, some people are like, ugh, just the consistency grosses them out. Because I'll be honest, I'm not a Mayo fan. You're gonna I'm... be. Okay. Um, so this needs a mixer, yeah? Yep, so I put that over here because there's just no room. Uh, I'm gonna put it in. If somebody Ooh, wants to turn it on, yeah. Go oh, for it. Shoot, I'll mess it up. How do I well, that's that exciting. Oh, I don't know. Maybe you should. <laughs> Okay, so we are just mixing that together until Wait, they are. Is it at uh, any particular speed? Well blended. No. Two to three minutes, so you can just leave it. Okay. Pop away. Okay. I just registered for this. Oh, this is very exciting. exciting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, they're so cute. My friend Dana got married, and she didn't have that on her registry. And I was like, we need, need this. Oh my god, I'm like so. And then, know. and then Mike, who my fiance, he's like crazy into cooking, so he like taught. Yeah, like I didn't know that. Oh my god, him and my mother talk about kitchen appliances all day and recipes and like I mean it's insane. Um, but yeah, so he's very excited. We got all the attachments to it too, which I, I know. I, I have a bunch of like pasta making. Yeah, that's what he was saying. It's like an additional like eighty bucks, and he's like, somebody can buy that. I have some ice cream Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh my god, I have a spiralizer. Oh, that's. I would say that this is pretty well blended. Well blended. And unfortunately I have to do this over here because it's all gloppy. We're just going to take our two eggs and add them one at a time until those are also blended. 
Bruce Bogtrotter, his name's hard to say, is forced to eat chocolate cake like this as, to punish him for gluttony. For steal well, to punish him for stealing the Trunchbull's cake. Yeah. Uh, what food would you like to be made to eat if you were in a similar situation? Like, what would you be like, okay. Ice cream. Pasta. That was easy. All right, well, <laughs> any discussion Honest to God, any kind of pasta, like, with any kind of sauce. Really? I could eat forever. Like, I'm Italian. Um, but, like, it just... What's your favorite if you had to choose? Like, like a shape, just of of pasta. Yeah. I love um, I love pasta like pastina with broth. Well, do you know what pastina is? No. It's like a really little 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 pasta. Do you know what pastina is? Mm -hmm. I know you're Italian. Mm -hmm. um, mm -hmm. I don't yeah. look it. No, you don't. I am. It's north. It's uh, she's like super up north. So it's a little teeny tiny pasta. It's almost like a little star. Uh -huh. And my mom used to make that when I was little with like homemade chicken broth. So you had like chicken and stars, but they were good. They were like the teeny tiny. That doesn't even seem like uh, Italian. Food. And then you crack an egg, yeah, in it, and you let the the broth soak into the, the pasta. And then when it you take it off the boiler, you put it um, with Parmesan a little uh, bit. That sounds, that sounds stupid. So good. good. I'm putting in one teaspoon of vanilla. Can I have to do this back here then? I also love spaghetti, like just a big just, fan of spaghetti. Just straight up spaghetti. With, with uh, plain tomato sauce. Have you been to La Pergoletta? No. I don't even know what that is. That's in Los Feliz. They do all like homemade pastas. Homemade pastas. It's really good. It just tastes like very clean yeah. and fresh. Like, there's and it's nothing, so good. There's nothing weird. No, it's gross all stuff. like not heavy. Pure. Yeah, it's so good. I love it. Mm -hmm. I love it. All right, so now we have to put in the flour. A little bit at a time. Okay. Do you want to try to do that? Sure. <laughs> I'll, I'll watch you do it and make fun of you. So I <laughs> yeah. yeah. So I turn it on a little bit. Yeah. Okay. Oh, no. And then you can also do it if you're like afraid of it. You can pull it up. Put a oh, it smells really good. good. And then you get nervous. Don't turn it any higher than that. Though, okay. Because then the flour will go yeah. everywhere. What so, would you choose, Kate? Yeah. What would oh. you choose? Oh, I'm curious. Um, I'm choosing macaroni and cheese. Oh, or, that's a good choice. Or mashed potatoes. Also good. Also, you know what? Those, okay, so I have spoken like a true Italian carbs. <laughs> like carbs a true Italian carbs. Irish person. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Just give me carbs. <laughs> <laughs> um, I actually, this is like deeply shameful, but I also feel okay about it. I don't like the fancy macaroni and cheeses. Like, I, don't I like prefer the simple stofers. Too. I want the stofers frozen mac and cheese. Yeah. It's so good. Give like me the money. <laughs> <laughs> no, I just like a craft mac and cheese. I love craft mac and cheese. I know I'm not crazy about the craft one. Or the Velveeta. I love yeah. like Velveeta. Give me, give me so those like, yeah. 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 Give me the preservatives you guys. Yeah. I know. Like, let's I know. do it. I know. And like every Italian hates me for liking macaroni and cheese oh, so much because oh, really? it's not al dente. Like you're not supposed to make it al dente. It's supposed to be kind of mushy. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I, I hate al dente. Oh, I, I know. I love al dente, but for whatever reason, with macaroni and cheese, it cannot be for me. And they're like, Oh my God, Danny, it's it's too cooked. I cannot eat this. <laughs> and I'm like, Okay, well relax. I'll eat it. Okay, <laughs> this part's kind of fun, so I'm gonna Ooh. see if I can do it over here so everybody can see. We're, We're gonna, gonna add the chocolate mixture. To it. This smells so good. I could drink this. Do it. I won't. And I'm, I'm gonna, gonna grab do this. It actually told us to alternate these things, but whatever. I don't think I'm gonna pour it. It doesn't matter. Go, go for it. To so just pour it while you're mixing, no? Yeah, it doesn't matter though. Oh. Okay, just be careful because now go I'm for it. Yeah, that's some chocolate, chocolatey, chocolatey goo. I might have to put it back on the thing. So this is what it looks like. Delicious. Yeah. Delicious. Let's see if I can do this by hand. Let me do this. The answer might be no. Chocolate soup. <laughs> Does it look like chocolate? Mm -hmm. Oh my god, it smells so good. And I don't like chocolate. You don't like chocolate? Mm -hmm. What? We chose a recipe you didn't like? What choice you guys? Way to go, go. idiot. <laughs> Um, I like, I, it's, it's funny, like, very specific chocolate cake, like, you guys, 
I don't know if you have them. I don't what? know if you, Do you guys have Entenmann's? Oh, oh yes. What okay. is Entenmann's? But do you have like all of the Entenmann's? Because here it's just like What do you mean California? Donut. Yeah. yeah. No, I love like, the, like, the like pound cake. cake. Yeah, okay. So you have like the display at the end of the aisle. I thought it was just an East Coast thing, but it, it's not in LA. I don't know why. Yeah, maybe it's only in the Bay Area then. That's I don't where know. you're from. Um, but I I'm, to, like, I'm, I'm sorry. It's just this, like dessert, like. I don't know, like I'm cookies kidding. and yeah, I'm Google it. Oh, um, so I have good. to get my brother to like mail me. What? Are you serious? It's because like they don't have all of. They just have the donuts here. That's all they have. Oh my god, I don't remember the last time that I I ate Entenmann's. I, I, I mean, how, how do you spell it? Uh, uh, e n t e men's. M e n. Yeah, it's a double a n n. Um, divide batter into cake pans about two and one third cup for each. So we oh, get we ate these. We used these in binge. Oh, what? did you really? Weren't they so good? Entenmann's. They were so good. <laughs> Are we allowed to say that brand? Oh shoot. We're, we're saying it's free good. publicity. We're saying it's good. It's fine. Yeah. Um, so, so I'm just gonna pour. Oh my god. Some in and see how it goes. So my mother, after she watched um, Binge, the very first thing she said to me, uh, spoken like a true, true uh, frosting holic. Oh my God, Daniela, did she eat all that frosting? And I was like, Yeah, Mom, she did. She's like, Oh my God, lucky bitch. <laughs> and I said, Mom, she almost got sick. I almost got sick. Yeah, I am. In recovery, I do not do that anymore. Yeah, and it was bad. Oh, and yeah. it was bad. My pee smelled like sugar for weeks. But you know what? I didn't feel bad about it because I have done my emotional homework. <laughs> How did you prepare for that? For yeah, what? for I, to, like you that. know, if you're... I didn't think about it. Oh, really? All right, oh. well, <laughs> oh, never mind. <laughs> Well, we were doing so, like, like I think, and people have asked me, like, was it triggering to reenact these behaviors and all of that? And, like, probably a little bit, but the fact of the matter is, is that there was such a small team of us. I was kind of acting as AD, producing, mm. making sure, you know, I was sending so, all the emails. I was so distracted. The acting of it was such a small part of getting that pilot made. Mm -hmm. There wasn't yeah, time actually, for me to I, get I triggered. know what that's like. Yeah, like I was just doing too much. Mm -hmm. The last thing on my mind was puking. Yeah, I can lift really good. Yeah. Don't worry, mm -hmm. there's plenty of. Um, okay. Yeah, the last thing I would worry about was like, am I going to gain weight on this show? Did I you? Care. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Well, care. Good. well, I mean. Sorry, what? guys. No, no, it's fine. What I remember too is after that Absolutely first thing. That's fine. Ah! I don't uh, know about this trick either. Oh, this trick? It, it yeah. Makes it, it makes it so the bubbles pop up and oh you don't get in the cake so much. So you just kind of bang it, it around. All, it also cleans everything out. It's brilliant. I remember after you licking all the frosting uh -huh. at these food, gross, but. which was super disgusting. I remember vividly you saying, "I need to eat real food right now." Yeah. Because then I'll feel better. And yeah. so we went and we had like a burrito yeah. or whatever. Mm. I don't even remember what we had. Yeah, I think we had burritos. Uh, but you immediately felt better. And I yeah. thought what I thought was interesting was is that coming from you writing the piece and knowing you obviously. Yeah. What was the cure for that was you eating like real food and eating like a normal meal. Like a normal meal yeah. instead of not eating or like yeah. trying to compensate. I was like, no, I need actual and nutrition. And you did. And you felt fine. And I felt better. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I mean, I still pee straight sugar. sugar. That's fine. That's fine. Whatever. You can't control that. In the future, I would use yogurt instead of frosting so you don't get sick. I bet you yogurt. If you eat, I mean, if you, you, eat a lot of, I you a lot. ate a lot of that. It was, it, it was like, gross. Really gross. It was super gross. gross. So now we're gonna put these in the oven <laughs> <laughs> for thirty to thirty-two minutes, and we're gonna turn the camera off for thirty to thirty-two minutes because Yay! we don't need to experience us just sitting around waiting for cake. Should we can talk? Is it the dog? Oh, yeah. I'm just um, looking this last piece. Can you get them all on the top rack? That would be great. Okay. Even if they're not centered, yeah. I would rather them all bake. This is exciting. If you want to be part of the process, visit Patreon.com.
patreon.com slash katehackett, and you could have a shout out here too.